Good morning, everyone. Dr. Victoria Skirbo here speaking to you from the Caesar Transformation Healing Center in Wareham, Massachusetts. Today is um, Friday, December 6th, and the moon is in Aries all day. Um, of course, the Aries moon, we have the moon in Aries, we have the sun in uh, Sagittarius. And so we, ha we do have a, um, a trine today between those two, uh, those two planets. It is a trine of self-expression. Uh, it has a Leo uh, vibe to it, or a Leo flavor, and so you can expect that uh, people will be speaking their minds. Um, it also can be a very creative time, and a very fiery time, because we're dealing with fire signs. We also have uh, in the sky at this time a grand water trine um, between the, the north node of the moon, Neptune, and uh, Mars. And, um, and that brings up a lot of... Um, a lot of emotion, so you might be feeling a lot of a lot of feelings, a lot of emotions. It is actually part of a of a kite uh, pattern if we include um, the south node of the moon, and we include uh, Venus and uh, Ceres, and so um, uh, that is a powerful combination. Of course, Venus is the goddess of love. Ceres is a goddess associated with uh, nurturance. And, uh, of course, the south node in Capricorn, uh, sort of smack in the middle, uh, letting go of the should've, could've, would'ves. Uh, and the issues can be around nurturance, um, especially if you, are, you spend a lot of time nurturing others. Perhaps uh, you need to sort of let go of some of that responsibility and, uh, and start nurturing yourself. Uh, you know it's that old adage of putting um, the oxygen mask on you on you first before you help other people in the plane as it crashes to the ground. <laughs> Sorry. Um, <clears throat> that being said, however, um, it might be a little bit easier than other days today because of all the fire. Fire tends to be so, so very self-referential. And uh, <clears throat> fire signs, or, or, or fire signs generally have to be very aware of their energy and where they're where they're uh, getting their energy, because once the energy, um, once the source of energy, like in the case of a candle, once the wick is gone, the fire is gone, and so fire signs tend to to be very aware of that. And and today, even for those of us who uh, t tend to give it all away, I think we'll be more aware of. Uh, of how not to to actually do that, um, we do have also a grand square with um, with the nodes of the moon, the moon and uh, the asteroid uh, Juno. Juno is now in Libra, and so we're we're being uh, tested. Our relationships are being tested, and uh, Juno opposite the moon today um, is. A question of how much am I giving away in my relationships? What am I keeping for myself? Um, and ultimately, we all have to sort of move in the direction of cancer, which is self-nurturance and, and feeling our feelings and sort of letting go of those obligations that uh, are hurting us. So that's kind of the energy of the day. Um, sorry it's so dark in here. Um, it's it's we're very early in the morning. <laughs> so... Have yourself a great day. Like and subscribe. I'll see you again soon. I'll, uh, check out my uh, Jupiter through the uh, the 12 signs. There are time stamps on it, so you should be able to find your your, uh, your time. Um, I mean, find your sign. Um, I would look at your, your sun sign, your, um, your moon sign, and your ascendant to get a full picture of, of what Jupiter in Capricorn is going to mean for you. Um, so I hope you enjoy that. Have a great day. Bye.